crazy things. It's oh so quiet. Why are you and Villanelle so interested in each other? It's oh so still. She's instinctive and it's flamboyant. And so peaceful. Wow, you look amazing. Can I take a picture of you for my Instagram? No, no, of course not. Get a real life. If she's alive, you need to find her. You blow up to see this is swell. You almost have this a This is out of control. <laughs> it feels like I'm I'm losing my mind a little bit. Guy caves in, never got loose. Blow, 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 fire fuse. Any ideas where she might have gone? Any feelings? No. No feelings. Cross your heart and hope to die. children are you friends with? Two days? This app, it's fake, obviously. My girlfriend said the same thing. It knew. That app said she was gonna die. Us. I think it's because of this app. I need a new phone. A new phone, new number, new service. The countdown app, it's really just a random number with a clock. It's not that scary, but it seems like it worked on YouTube clowns. This must be everyone that downloaded the app. My sister. The Breaking Bad prequel spinoff, Better Call Saul, takes the number five spot. This crime drama on AMC is about a con man turned small-time lawyer named Jimmy McGill. The series begins six years prior to the events of Breaking Bad, showing his transformation into his persona of Saul Goodman. Not to give away any spoilers, but there are post-Breaking Bad moments included in the show as well. If you're a fan of the aforementioned show, you should be watching Better Call Saul. Even if you're not, it's a great show on its own. The first season gets off to a rocky start, but finds its groove in seasons two and three. There are even some episodes in the second and third season that match the quality level of that other show. Three seasons have already been broadcast. Better Call Saul returns on AMC for season